What's going on guys? Token Vaping. Um, today's use review is another flavor from an ongoing line that I've had um, a huge opportunity to be able to do. Um, I've done their one flavor from them so far and I've already wiped through that bottle. Just It was a great, great flavor. Um, these guys are, are coming out of Florence, Oregon and uh, they do have a website and they're also on Facebook. They're on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter and they just two good friends that have, have over about 10 years experience doing this um, great 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 guys take this very 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 seriously not that everybody else doesn't uh, but these guys I mean they use an I ISO 8 lab uh, they have a clean room they have uh, inspection pro policies for each individual bottle like not just as a batch I mean they check out every single bottle um, to ensure that everything that's going out is just as as high quality top shelf is what they would expect to use themselves that they're giving you um, they do offer three nicotine uh, options at zero three and six and they are offered in 60 ml bottles the line is called cloud mob vapor they do have a website it's cloudmobvapor.com and i'm only saying it like that just because every time i say it quick it sounds like mod it's cloud mob mob as in the family and that's what they're about is family whether it's vaping community whether it's immediate family whether it's close friends but it's all about family so with that the first one that i did uh was called the don it's a strawberry cream really smooth really solid it's an 80 20 mix very very enjoyable vape if you check out my other video about that flavor like i said i've already gone through that bottle um so the next one that i'm going to do is the hitman boom and this one is their uh fruity cereal with a milk finish i do know a few other people on instagram that i follow and i've talked to that have talked highly about this flavor as well so i decided to give this one a shot um, this is their bottle it is a 60 ml bottle it does have a safety ring on it i can sit here all day and do this and it won't come off so we will bust that open um, there is the name of the company cloud mob vapor nicotine level here and that is the bottle size it also has the website marking here this now I did say this on the other video as well I'm a big fan of the labels and the way that they did the artwork on this because it has a very graphic novel comic book noir style and I'm a big fan of that style so it's really really cool um, that is the name of the flavor and then it has all the warning labels and ingredients on this side as well as all their social media um, like I said you know just I've had an opportunity to talk to them um, a little bit more on a personal level so I've learned you know how dedicated they are to this um, how much effort and uh, attention to detail that they put into all of what they do they 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 make sure that their ingredients you know are just as high quality as the the overall juice is as well so you know they try to make sure that no stone is is left unturned so to speak and that they dedicate all of their their efforts into making this as phenomenal a line to put out there as possible now i did save this for a first vape first view since this is going to be um, a single flavor uh, review for this so we are going to pop that open i did re-wick as you can see brand new and as always with my cotton that i use it's texas tough cotton right there um it's I'm just a big fan of the cotton I've since the first time that I've used it way back when when I first started doing reviews um, not from the very beginning but once I found out about them and I reached out to them and I was able to try their cotton I've been hooked ever since um, it's just a really easy to wick cotton um, it holds flavor very very well and you know it just it seems to be just more durable than others that I've worked with so if you are interested on Instagram it's Texas Tough Cotton so we're going to go ahead and pop this open and we're going to do a first vape first view now i do want to reiterate that no matter what and there's the pop as you see this on here yep that's a fruity cereal but i'll be i'll be honest with you i actually i do get more of a creamier odor a smell to that odor means it smells bad no i do get a creamier smell to that than i do with a lot of other cereal flavors that i have i have tried that actually that's a really good smell so we're gonna go ahead and i'm going to rip the, juice this up and we are going to test this out and hopefully this will be as good as the first one was um, now i do want to reiterate anytime that you get a product and there is some kind of safety seal on it whether it's a seal tape 
flap, cap, lid, whatever. Um, anything that is meant to be there for security and safety precautions. If something about it, for whatever reason, makes you feel uncomfortable, makes you second guess it, makes you question whether or not it's safe to use, don't use it. Um, just contact where you got it from, contact the company that makes it, contact whoever distributes it, and let them know so that they can take steps to rectify the situation and send you the product in its proper form. Um, and that way you feel safer about using it overall because no matter what, regardless of the juice, regardless of the device, regardless of anything, at the end of the day, it's all about your health and safety, period. Bar anything else, that's the main important goal. So just make sure you keep an eye on that. You know you better than anybody else does. So we just definitely need to keep an eye out for that. So I'm going to do a quick pre-burn. this up a little bit more and we're going to actually hit this up and see if this tastes out now while I'm doing this I just want to reiterate you know no matter what I say about my opinion and my my reviews and my taste preferences things like that you have to remember that legitimately is just my opinion um, in no way, shape, or form am I trying to impose my will on anybody. I'm not trying to force my opinion on anybody. I'm just trying to give a more informative um, inf uh, base to go off of so that you have a, a better uh, background to go off of to decide whether or not this is something that you might want to try. Um, we all have different preferences. We all have different, different tastes. And, you know, bottom line, no matter where we're, no matter what your vaping ability is, no matter what your preferences are, everybody has their, everybody has their specifics. So all I'm trying to do is just let you know what I get out of it. And hopefully that might help you um, come to a better decision making uh, process as far as to if it's something you want to try. So just keep that in mind here. So as always, I'm vaping on 75 watts. This is Hitman from Cloud Mob Vapor. As always, like I said, there's no clouds. Okay, and because of the way that I'm this, uh, I wicked this one up. Um, I went with a different RDA this time, so the cotton on it, it doesn't take as much cotton as my other RDA does. So that's why I have to make sure that it stays juiced up and that's why I'm redoing this now so just bear with me here a moment put this back on clouds I think I found my cereal flavor. Um, the initial, the the fruit aspect of it, the fruity cereal flavor for it, I will tell you up front is, I mean, it, it it's it's somewhat of a common flavor. I mean, if you've ever had a fruit flavored cereal, you kind of have an idea already of what to expect out of this out of this vape. However, what I'm impressed with on this on this is the actual milk finish now a lot of times you get a cereal flavor and they say that there is a creamy finish to it or a milky uh, exhale on it as well and sometimes you get kind of you get kind of the creaminess to it um, a lot of times for me it ends up being more of like a dry cereal out of the box and I've never been a fan of that taste just because it's way too sweet for me um, However, this actually has a milkier, um, 
a milkier finish taste to it. Like after you have a, a spoonful of milk from a bowl of cereal, that aftertaste that you get off of that, that's what I get from this. That gives it more of an authentic actual bowl of cereal and milk flavor for me. Um, so actually, in that sense, it definitely hits the taste palette a bit better for a milk cereal flavor. Um, but I mean, when it comes to cereal flavors, there are so many out there. I mean, everybody's gonna have a specific one that they prefer. For me, out of all the ones that I have tried, this actually has a better milk finish than I have had in others. Um, so I'll leave it up to you to decide, you know, but it so far, two for two, both of them, uh, both flavors so far, absolutely solid. Clouds are amazing. Um, flavor is smooth as silk. Um, no throat hit whatsoever. It's all flavor. It's all vape uh, clouds. Um, definitely hit them up. You know, like I said, they're all over social media. They have their own website, Cloud Mob Vapor, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Definitely check them out. You know, it's a great bargain. Um, it's a 60 ml bottle. So, I mean, it's not like you're getting shorted in juice whatsoever. And it's an amazing vape so far that I have discovered. Like I said, I've already plowed through the strawberries and cream. Great, great flavor on that one. Um, but if you like cereal flavors, definitely try this. I feel that it would definitely become one of the one of your better choices for that option. Um, but definitely hit them up, Cloud Mob Vapor. As always, guys, it is a true honor. Thank you so much. I hope to continue to be able to do this for you guys. Guys, vaping community, vape family, everybody out there, thank you so much. I am so privileged and honored that you guys take the time to watch my videos, to check me out on Instagram. Um, anything that I can do to help enhance your vaping experience, that's all I want to do. So in any way, shape, or form that I can help you, please, by all means, reach out to me. Let me know. I will do everything that I can. As always, I'm Token Vaping here on YouTube, Snapchat, Instagram, Pinterest, uh, Facebook. Um, reach out to me. I always try to respond back when I can. And hopefully we'll go from there and we'll keep this going and everybody will have a more enjoyable vaping experience. Until next time, vape on, vape strong. Have a good night.